What's up guys, Tall Team Og here. Welcome back to Life is Strange, episode one. I know Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard mm. in the shop and I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed. I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk oh about Oh my Rachel. god. I'd never let one of photography's few Okay, been through that. Not sure if I have one. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I have one. Given your selfie output, I'm sure you must have about a thousand pics by now. It'll take a long time to find a good one. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Ooh. Go Getting on. all deep in here. Don't let me stop you. Look. No. Control. Whoa. I just worked so hard in the shot, and I'm sure you know what it's like to be concerned. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes. Excuse you. No, Victoria. Okay. Excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's futures. John Lennon said. I'm on top of it. I think John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. <laughs> Max. You're on fire today. Uh, oh my All God. the right answers. Good. Make sure you finish working on it by today. I have faith in you. My new powers, I sound awesome. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Can you please, sprint? Please. I can't tell right, anybody. Let's go. They'll think I'm crazy. So last time I saw that one uh What's that got to do with that uh okay, fire alarm Max, retrace every step. I'm guessing I have to press it. I washed my face. Mm -hmm. I shredded my photo. Mm -hmm. Then the butterfly flew in. Then the the and pizza. I took a photo. The pit there. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. He you is. You know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Oh, uh, hell no. What are you doing? Don't Come on, I got this. Down. Tell me what to do. Wow, sir, it's happening again. I need a hammer to break it open. Oh my god, I need a hammer. more trouble for this than drugs. Looks like Samuel forgot to take the cleaning cart out of here. Oh my, okay. Shoot. Holy shit, Hurry I can't up. let this Hurry happen. Up. If I can reverse time again, Hurry I up. can help her. I wonder how we'll get around this. Oh shoot. I was too late. Your punk ass. Would right. he, would Let's go. Ever even missed your punk ass, Oof. would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh. Shiz. Let's go farther. All right, let's do this. Tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying the hell? to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Oh, would I have it already. Ever even miss your punk ass, would they? No way. Don't ever touch me again, freak. Son. Another shitty day. Oh my God, he just that ran out there happen. holding it. This cannot be real. I, I think just it's saw a girl pretty get real. Shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? You're a superhero, Do girl. Not freak out. Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should be outside. I had to use the bathroom. Girls always use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm well, I did pull out. it. Then trip I mean, on out of here, Missy. Or I had a good some? reason, so... Huh? Thank you, Mr. Whatever. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone, and please turn off that alarm <laughs> since that's your job. Mm. Go on. Move along. Move along. What's up, bruh? What up? You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... I'm just a little worried about my future. 
Are you sweating pinballs? Is that all you're thinking about? Pinballs? You can always be up front with me, Max. I or never have you done heard something that before. wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Man. Oh, should I? Uh, uh. I'll hide it. He doesn't need to know. I just got sick in class. Um, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you the think hell? that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the no. truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's Should nothing I? to hide. I got sick. Mm. It happens, you know. There's that teen toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've Can't only been here for right three now. weeks, and you're already causing conflict. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with the class. What happens Please. if I tell him the truth? No, he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Alright, I'm gonna tell the truth. I guess I could rewind and actually tell him the truth. I'm gonna tell him the truth. You look a All little right. stressed out. Are you okay? I'm... Nope. I'll tell you. I hope you believe me. I or you might not. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around. In the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. Yes. You sure? Yes. That's why he I pressed the a fire alarm. talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mm -hmm. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family. Oh, buddy. And one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the uh -huh. girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then... Then he left. I ran what? out here wondering what, about the what girl? to do. Are you going to bust him? This is serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. All right. That's it? After what I told we'll you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. Of course this right. academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? Ah, oh, shiz. What should I do? <laughs> Cause now they know they would find out that I reported him. But whatever. Left mouse. Okay. Whatever. Uh, I'll stick with it. It's a fairly innocent-looking high school academy. Prescott, please come to the front office. Are you in trouble, boy? I hope you hit that gun. Fountain. Sit and ponder. Ponder our situation. This day has been so insane. Yep. Everything is happening too fast. And none of it makes any sense. So cinematic. These visions, this power. I keep expecting to wake up one more time. But if this is a dream, then I'm not asleep. Which means somehow I did rewind time. And so there has why? to be a reason. And I have to find out why. Yes, you do. Alright, let's get him. Squirrel! 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 Come back here! Squirrel! Okay. Coins. Tab. Journal. I hope so. What am I doing? Photo shoot? Please. 
<laughs> All right. Okay then. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. And where is that? Okay. Profiles. Talk to you later. Oh. Okay. Let's go to the dorm. Where's where is that? Close. I could go for a burger now. Me too. Mm. I I'm craving in and out. Just Warren's now. waiting for me and his flash drive in the parking lot, so I better get back to my dorm. Where's your dorm? That way? Is it this way? Okay. Looks like it. Birthday! Come on, Logan, bring it, brah! Bring it, brah! Yeah, brah! All right, brah. So totally wrong. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. All right. Wait. I gotta look at it. The Prescott dormitory. Good lord, Nathan's family owns my dorm. Oh, that makes it even worse. I can't go in there. So that means everyone's gonna turn on me. Um, you guys want to move, huh? Oh look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. Wow. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. I will slap you in the face. The Dagarian processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> oh my God. Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. How about I oh, kick you in the face? Hold that pose. And so I'll shove that camera. Out. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, wow. why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh yes, Victoria. I'll get your this bunny ass out of my way. Dick. Sorry, no paparazzi allowed. Is there a punch button? Punch you and your baby maker. Can I? I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. It's, if I was her, I would punch her in the face, go back in time, punch her again, go back in time, go back in time and kick her in the face again, or kick her in the face and butt. Then I would go back in time and just, you know, as if nothing happened. <laughs> what the hell? There you go. Are you kidding? Genius. Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Oh my you god, know how much it's a cashmere. Cost? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. You got no, you got it on cotton on. Calm down. I'm not dogging cotton on. That's where this sweater is from. <laughs> oh, he's gonna drop something. I oh, know, never mind. No. What Do girl? you understand English? Get lost. Sorry, I, I'm from a different country. I don't understand that. Hmm. I need to get that. Climb this? No. Ooh, football. Can I play catch with you guys? Can I play catch with you, bruh? Huh, bruh? Bruh. Wait, what happens if I turn back time? Ooh, okay. Let me get... Let me see where I could get that. Yo, wait, 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 wait. 
There goes Samuel da Vinci to paint the window. Ah, right here. Okay. Temper. There we go. Time okay, travel let's hijinks. Let's see if this works. This is so cool. All right. Hurry it up, Sammy. Oh, okay. I'll crank up the. Nice, bro. Crank it up. What the hell? Are you? All right. Here we go. Sabotage. <laughs> Oops. No way. Oops. No fucking you okay, way. Victoria? Oh, Samuel, I'm sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair. Nope. Sorry. Get the hell away from me, weirdo. Oh. Hold on. Nice, hold bro. On. We'll get some towels. <laughs> we'll be right back. So move your ass before I drive. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. <laughs> awesome. Awesome. Hey, kick some in your face. What up, girl? Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I mean, I could be a dick. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. Okay. Where'd you get it? It was. But there'll be another. Of course. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. No. You're welcome. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. Unfortunately, you're one of those. Awesome. If you, you guys watch me Mean Girls, Sorry she's like a plastic. Sorry about blocking you and, and the go fuck your selfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. See guys, look what happens days, when you're you know? trying to be friendly. I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. I mean, yeah, it takes a... You can't back down from a challenge, Victoria but still, probably played you me. can be nice. I should have played her. Better get to my room before I find Warren. Nah, I, I, I think that was genuine. I mean, come on. Let's have hope for humanity. Red rum. Red rum. Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. No, going <laughs> nice reference. So Juliet. Juliet, extreme reporter. Okay. Same missing girl. She's probably gonna go into play. Toilet paper. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. Tepe. Ooh, the showers. Okay, missing persons. That's my room. Peek in here. Be the change you wish to see. Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. Oh, okay. That's her room. <laughs> yeah, she totally likes the teacher. It's late. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Hey, looks like my guitar. Home sweet home. My favorite cocoon. She has a dorm room to herself? That is... That's awesome. Dude, this is a nice place. Hi, Mom. <laughs> my mom's last text was my birthday. Dang. Call me ASAP. Alright then. How do I call you? 
never mind. See, kind of book she I'm reads. glad Kate let me borrow her copy of the October Country. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. I've only read one. Fahrenheit, uh, is it 9-11? Fahrenheit 7-11? I don't remember. I remember it, it was a good book. Philip Lorca de Corsia, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. It's pretty cool because um, I'm also sort of a photographer. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Oh, remember that one wood thing said, uh, BFFs, pirates? It's probably, probably them. Let's play some tunes. Hey. The style of this game really reminds no, me of Juno. Hamilton, the greatest. Like the sketchiness and the music. And I like it. Teddy. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. Aww, when I Teddy named your Captain. Eye and my parents rushed me to the ER, I knew we were bonded forever. Oh, it has one eye. That's why. Okay. I could look at the power strip. Oh, no, I want to keep that on. It's pretty. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. Totally not hipster. But cool looking. I'll lie down. Oh yeah. I was supposed to get something. Sorry. I like these uh, minimalist posters. Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? Hmm. Hey, where's that? Ooh, cookies! I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. Hey, I'd it's love that. hard to that. believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. Okay. Clothes. You, you, you barely have it's any clothes. It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I like my wardrobe. This is here. I'm supposed to find the USB. Look. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Streets outside your way. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. I am oh. so addicted to this site. Camera Look porn. at these vintage beauties. <laughs> Dang, she's super into retro old school stuff. I would be too. Mine makes me laugh. It's pretty cool. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. <laughs> so I have to go to Dana's. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Oh, let's water the plant. You are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. Drink up. Drink up. What? It's gonna have consequence? What? What? I just watered the plant. Come on. Should I unwater it? <laughs> okay. Wait, what if I turn this off? Will this do anything? Okay, let's save some power. DVDs. One day I'll organize my film collection. One day I'll get an actual HD TV. I can't wait to expand my film collection. Okay, let's go to Dana's room. 
Wait. Take a look at herself and take a selfie. Say chase. The hell? Don't mess with Welcome my girl. To the real drama queens of Blackwell. Yo. Hey, Juliet. Hey. Get off Is the phone. Everything cool? Oh yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. You are ridiculous. Uh, what'd she do? What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. <gasps> Ouch. Sexting. How did you find out? <laughs> uh, why do you care? Why are you even Man, asking me? You blame never your talk. boyfriend. Just zone out with your camera. He's just That's super thirsty. You now. What's my last name? Uh. You look like a. Hmm. You look like an Olsen. Juliet. Ju Juliet Olsen. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. Watson. By the way, Juliet Watson. I'll slap you. Okay. Going back in time. Alright. Hey, Juliet. Oh, yes, Max. I've. You're totally Juliet Watson. Juliet Watson, you be nice. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Uh, I know of course everything. I do. Thanks. I locked Dana in because she was sexting Zach, my boyfriend. Unbelievable. If you don't let me out, I will scream. Why would she do would that? Dana do that? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. Ooh. According to Victoria. She a hoe. Huh. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight but Victoria, to you can't trust Victoria. The hell? It's messed up. Leave me alone, Max. Get a clue. Oh my God! Look at Dana's all this drama. Still a cheerleader at heart. Okay, so I'm guessing I should go to Victoria's, and she has it unlocked. Luckily. Why would you leave your room open? Wow. Pretty clean. Take her camera. She's actually got a classic medium format camera with some awesome prime lens. Ouch. At least she puts her photographs out there. Unlike me. Huh? I guess. Use. Is she going to get a 3D printer for her dorm room? Dang. Maybe I will join her posse. She's freaking ballin'. What the heck? How come her... Man, her camera costs more than her 3D printer. Okay, if I did wear expensive jewelry, I would wear this for sure. Yes, I get it. Enter the Vortex Club. What the hell is the Vortex? No. Club. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. Boom. This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. Yep. Busted. Yo. Your girl ain't loyal. I'm not letting her out until she tells the truth. Oh my god. Wait, what was I supposed to do? I thought I forwarded it. Do I take a picture of it? Oh, print email. Pick up the pr printed email. Here. Nope. Oh, right there. Hey, she got a TV too. This Look better all... convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Look at all those lenses. She is ballin'. 
Jeez. Juliet, read this. It's not photoshopped. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, yep. Dana. Yeah, you are. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zach? No. But I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Insecure. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. Yeah, punch him you in the dick. You set me free. Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. What's with all these super low cut showing off their cleavage? Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. Just realize it's all the cheerleaders. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Must protect my precious, so Max never has to chase it down again. My precious. <laughs> All right. What's up, girl? Hey, Dana. Seriously, thanks again. I can't believe Juliet locked me in my own room. Real mature. Yeah, Victoria is not nice. Victoria is not nice. I don't get it. She has She's everything. She's not nice. And to pull that prank on a friend? Just because they're in the Vortex Club doesn't mean they're BFFs. I'm in it, and Victoria creeps me out. Max, you're smart to be a loner here. Though, Warren obviously likes hanging with you. Mm, what do you mean? What do you mean? Oh, nothing. When you opened the flash drive, didn't you see the special folder called Max? Yeah, okay. I gotcha. Why? What's in the special folder? I wanna know. What? I wanna know. Flash drive. I better make sure everything is still in there. I oh, yeah. think Warren forgot to sure. hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. I have my self-respect. <laughs> is that is that porn? Can I open it? <laughs> I wanna see what's in the max folder. Well, come on. Yeah, stalker pictures of me? Use. Of course a popular cheerleader like Dana would have a million friends. Flash drive. I can't... I better make sure everything is still in there. Okay. I think Warren forgot to hide the party buster folder. Not that I would open it no matter how tempting. What's up, girl? I have myself Yeah, respect. check yourself out. Okay. Um... Bye. Where's your bra? Fuck this shit! Oh, whoa. Ow, that hurt. Damn, I better rewind. Dang, that's messed up, bro. I got you, girl. Fuck this shit! Block it. Ow. Oh, okay, never mind. Alyssa, Yo. move your head. If to the left. Insist, Max. There you go. Like a boss. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. And she actually listened. <laughs> this will have consequences. The broken glass? Ah, okay. Max, that was awesome. Thank you. Thank you. No problem. No problem. You have quick reflexes. Years of mad dodging skills. Well, he's never change. That's why you're better yep. off. They're smart. We should hang out more. Now I have to finish this stupid book. All right then. What's your problem, bro? Get lost, hipster. I'm not doing any interviews. I should punch you in the dick. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Ooh, intervene. Let's go. 
Hey. Hey, Why leave, her you leave her alone. Excuse us. You this dick. is official campus business. Excuse me. You shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey. Nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. Man, messing you're with all the quiet the problem, ones. Missy. I will remember this conversation. Good. I hope you do. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. You're Anytime, welcome. Kate. You're welcome, Kate. I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. Maybe I should... Nope, I'm not rewinding that. I'm proud of that. He better remember that. I'm glad I stepped in that time. Can't stand to see people being bullied. So many missing persons posters. I'm probably gonna. Come that's gonna. Over here. Please. Oh my god. He sounds so boyish. What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. How are you? No problem. Oh, no hug for you, bro. <laughs> Check out my new wheels. Cool. Very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in Dang. the wrong time, Warren. This cool but then, guy. So am I. You okay? It's been one strange fucking day. I oh, bet. Yeah. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. Huh. Really? Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so yeah, you that drama want. ended well. So, did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? Never mind. The what? Uh. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, thanks. You had some cool shit on there. From Akira to Twilight Zone? Dang, which Akira? Which apropos today. An Akira I reference? A pop That's tight. Cultural pirate connoisseur. That does sound better than thief. Pirates. Ha ha. Make sure you watch Cannibal Holocaust. Seen it. I've seen everything. Seen it. I was more disturbed by all those emo vampire movies in there. Can a sensitive high school boy love sensitive vampires too? So this you're is still sensitive. a better love story than Twilight. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. Faster pussycat kill kill! <laughs> no, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Oh, Who would beat I know your you, sensitive I, ass I know down. you want that. If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. Should I tell him? Are we like, I don't know how close we are. Uh... I mean, he seems like one of the, one of my closer friends, I, I guess. I'll, I'll I need to talk to somebody, me. just to get it out of my system. Dr. Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me everything. Mm -hmm. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarre experience in Mr. Jefferson's class Actually, today. I mean, I feel like life I don't want to. Tell him anymore. Have you ever had a dream <laughs> so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm one of his students. What the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you told the principal? Now. Oh, F Answer off, me, bro. bitch. 
I told him the truth. I told him the truth. A student had a gun. No, you told him I had a gun. That's you why you dragged have a gun. me into his office. And did what? Give you a stern lecture? Nobody. Nobody lectures me. Everyone and tries to. You probably though. bribed him too. <laughs> Try. You should talk to somebody, Nathan. Do not analyze me. I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. Am I taking the step back or am I telling him to take a step back? I could call the police. I mean... Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh man, you're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude! Hell yeah. Oh. Hey, leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do! Not oh, my parents, hells not the principal, nah. or that whore Wait, in the bathroom! <gasps> Oh, he's gonna die? Oh, whoa. Max? I thought he was gonna get hit. Chloe? No way. You again. Go, oh, go, I got this. You, oh, yeah, get you it, totally Max. got it. <laughs> get your punk asses out of there now. Don't even try to run. Nobody. Nobody. <laughs> Little late there, cop. Nathan Prescott is messed up and dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. Thank you. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing. Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. Yeah. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? Nah, I like Seattle. I used to live in near. I used no, to live in it Washington. No, felt like a real city for artists, big and bright, great for taking pictures. Yeah. yeah, must be hard coming back to a hick town like Arcadia again. Not after seeing you. Please, girl, you came back for Blackwell Academy. Uh, of course. Of course, it's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. Don't you think I'm happy to she see you? She wants a D. No, <laughs> you were happy to wait five years without a call or even a text. She wants a DSLR. Give me a break. Give me a break. I was going through changes. Like you. I guess those changes included dumping me from your life. That's not true, Chloe. Hey, Bullshit. hey. Bullshit. You thought you hook up with all these art pricks in Seattle. Didn't happen, though. You're merciless. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliche geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. I like her hair. Broken. Oh, man, are you serial? Wow, Aww. haven't heard that one in a while. Not everything changes. Are you serious? Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche <laughs> has a boatload of tools. Maybe you can fix it at my place. I need very specific tiny tools. Bird alert. My stepdad has a fully stocked garage. And he actually is a tiny tool. <laughs> Welcome home, Max. <laughs> I like that. Dang, she could fix a camera? A Polaroid camera? That's tight. What a lovely home.
Come on in. Don't be shy. The house still looks nice. Home shit home. <laughs> She has a lot of room. Everybody lies. No exceptions. My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. Just gotta let it go. Okay. Nice medication. I don't know if the mic caught that, but my stomach is extremely hungry. <laughs> I think this junk swallowed her discs. Let's use her computer. She looks super happy. Aww. Who took the picture, though? Hmm. She looks super sad. Okay, that's a selfie. She looks super stoned. And I'm super done. Missing persons. So it was Chloe who printed all those flyers. Oh. Okay. Man, I'm hungry. I mean, like, physically. Don't mind me, I'm just gonna search your room. I guess I found your mixtape. <laughs> hey, give me that! Sorry, I wasn't trying to be nosy. Obviously, she's oh, a good Oh, is that friend. that Amber girl? Putting it mildly. Oh, okay. Rachel Amber. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Yeah, I put them up. She was my angel. After my dad died and you moved, I felt abandoned. Oh. Rachel saved my life. Well, I'm back. Man, I had no idea. Well, you never made much effort to find out. I was 14. We were best friends. I never forgot. I never forgot. Even if I was an asshole and didn't keep in touch. But you had Rachel. Rachel had my back. We were gonna kick the world's ass. You would laugh at how different we were. She wanted to be a star. She looks like a model. That was her plan. Our plan. Get the hell out of Bigfootville and into Los Angeles. A LA. So what happened? So what happened? Did your folks, your mom, try to stop you? My mom was too busy hooked up with Sergeant Shithead. I feel the love. Now, when did Rachel actually disappear? Six months ago. She just left Arcadia. Without a word. Oh. Without me. How do you know? How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. I believe you. I'm just trying to get all deductive. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed- Whoa, what happened? My bad. Changed her life. Then poof. And you haven't heard anything from her since? Like everybody in my life. My dad, you, and Rachel. Gone. Can you put on some music now? All right. Let's, let's put on some chill vibes. Where's your... What's in the closet? Oh, this is a flashback to youth. Our super secret closet lair. Search. <gasps> Dude, nice job. No, no. Thanks. Oh, my bad. I won't break it anymore. 
My bad, my bad. Look. Old cardboard boxes. Search through here. And it reeks like dirty laundry. Gross. This postcard is from Rachel Ember. It's from Oregon. Oh, Arcadia is in Oregon. Okay. We had such a blast drawing these together. Hey, drew that. Pretty good for her. Young, younger kids. Hey, that TV used to be in the living room. More pictures. Look at that. Aww. Chloe and her dad were so close. Is that a cat? <laughs> I love animals. Switch it on. And we have power. Oh, okay. How's... I was supposed to do that anyways. There we go. Let's get some music. Party. Anyway. You can find tools to fix your camera in the garage. Chloe, are you okay? Sure, I'm awesome. I just want to blaze and be alone for a moment. All right. I'll leave you be. Arcadia Bay. You can't go home again, said Thomas Wolf, but Sure I am. I like this music. Very relaxing. Should I splash water on my face again? Whoa, dark. I cannot see. Whoa, dark. I cannot see. Whoa, dark. Okay, I get it. I cannot see anything. I'll turn on the light. God. <laughs> Whoa, dark. I hope Chloe isn't taking these pills. What, what do they do? I'm not too sure. I like Chloe's new hair color. She's the opposite of shy. Of me. Yeah, I like it too. This is definitely Joyce's makeup. Chloe wouldn't use animal products. Right, let's get to the garage. <coughs> Doesn't look oh, like the Price bills. family is rolling in dough these days. Electricity bill. Oh man, I think I left the light on in the bathroom. Oops. Nope. Someone locked it from the other side. Of course. Hi, Kate. Yep, he was an asshole. 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 Okay. Yeah, let's turn on all the electronics. Years. Seems like forever. Joy still works at Two Wells Diner. <clears throat> Best damn burgers in Arcadia. I better get one soon. Oh, I want a burger. Yum, that looks tasty. Oh, so much food. I do miss Joyce's cooking. My stomach. I need food. Wait, did she say the shed or the garage? Burr. I can feel autumn pushing out the summer. Can I go in here? Nope. Wait. Okay. Can I swing? 
Oh, I loved this swing. William made it just for me and Chloe. Where's the doggy? That took Chloe and me the whole day to draw. It's almost invisible now. Oh, that's pretty cool. Barbecue. William used to grill awesome burgers for us. On the Bobby. I wonder if he was the last one to use this. I should be able to find the tools I need here. Here? Nothing. This is so lame. It's so lame. So lame. There's a blue plank, right? Do I need that? Chloe's stepdad is a veteran and a security guard? He must really hate her. <laughs> Dang. Respect. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants to put surveillance cameras all over the school? Wait. How paranoid can you get? That was him? Respect, but he's a dick. Hmm. One of these guns is missing. I hope Chloe's stepdad isn't packing heat. He probably is. Yes! Score! Boom! Precision screwdrivers. Hey, I have those. Except, I can't reach them. I'm gonna shake it. Catch it, catch it. Great. That was very smart, dumbass. Turn that off. No can reach. Too much noise. Let's see. The tools are stuck, out of reach, and no way in hell to get them. Oh, okay. Brilliant, Max. Brilliant. I know what to do. I'm gonna slide that cardboard under, then have the tools fall down on it. I'm genius. There we go. Like a boss. Yes, you have mad skills, Max. Dude, I wish I had time travel powers. I've got the tools. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. Wait, let me check what's in here. Another TV. Oh, what? Switch on. What the? Chloe's stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For reals? Oh, shiz. This guy has serious trust issues. Do Chloe and Joyce even know about this? Okay. I want to remember this, so... Crazy. Wowzer, a map of Blackwell Academy. I wonder why. Oh, the cameras. Let's close that. No password. Like it would help me find tools anyway. Corn beef. Shit! Butterfingers! Oh, shiz. I probably shouldn't touch that. Wait. Hold on. Let me see what it is first. Kate Marsh? 
Why the hell would he have pictures of her? Okay, this is getting totally weird. Oh. What the hell? Okay, I'm just gonna... What? Okay, I, I definitely have to pull it back. Because he would find out. Can I clean this up? Dang it. Okay. Trophy. Oh, food. Look at all that food. That's like enough spam for a hundred years. Cool. Now it's opened. Okay, cool. Check out the muscle car. Chloe's stepdad must be a gearhead. Alright, let's go back upstairs. You know he has a camera installed in every room. Yeah, about that. You found the tools. Sweet. You can sit at my desk and fix your camera. Okay. So? I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah, I just took them today. Let me see. Wait, I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? In the bathroom today, you set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. Wow. Now tell me the truth, you Max. Remember. I'll tell you the truth. I mean, you're my friend. I was there, hiding in the corner. Damn, you're a ninja. I a am ninja. A ninja would have cut Nathan's head off. I just took a butterfly photo. <laughs> that is so badass. Thank oh, you. Oh yeah, I almost wet myself when I saw the gun. So, did you recognize me? Well, you were in the bathroom, so... You could clean yourself up. I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure. I know I look a lot different. I was scared, too. I, I couldn't see straight. I don't blame you, Max. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Yeah. Uh, Just a bit. There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money. Drugs. Uh, only? But that's it. <laughs> now for the big question. <laughs> Did you tell anybody? Yeah. Oh, no. Actually, no, I didn't. I didn't tell anyone. Like who? Like anybody. Stop stalling, sister. The principal. But he didn't seem to believe me. The principal? Yeah, but I Are didn't you still tell, 12? Tell about that the drugs. drug jackass only cares about cash from Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. I didn't mention you at all. Swear. Yeah. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. looking for I uh, know it was your birthday last month look at her badass necklace this was my real father's camera I want you to have it that's so cool you remembered my birthday but I can't take this of course you can my dad would be pissed if I never used it and now I know it'll be used awesomely <laughs> and I'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion Cool. Aw. Yes, of course it's cool. And a butterfly Thank you. matches this your hair. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Insane Check in the membrane. Ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. <laughs> I got sunburned, 
This day couldn't get any stranger. Alright, take a picture? Let's take a picture. Work it, girl. Work it. That's right. Mm hmm. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock Let's out, go. girl. Did, yes, did she say it down, rock man. out with an AWK? Yo, turn it off. Turn it off. How many times have I told you to stop blasting that punk shit? Dude, the music's not even on. <laughs> oh shoot! Oh no fucking way! You need to hide now. Jump out My the window. Will kill me if he finds you here. Chloe, what's going on? Open this door, please. Chill. I'm changing. Is that okay? Pause it. Max, find a place to hide now. Pause it. Chloe, I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Oh shiz. Oh shiz. Stupid lamp. Chloe, I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Hurry up, Give hurry me a up. minute. Don't get smart. Just let me in now, please. One second. My bra is stuck. I'm not <laughs> shit. What's going on in here? Jesus, I'm just trying on clothes. You're so friggin' paranoid. Yeah, combat. We'll do that to you. One of my guns is missing. Did you take it? Oh, oh God, I didn't take your stupid gun. She might you have do it. know I believe in gun control? Wait, is that grass? Especially after You've been token up again in here? Oh, yeah, guns, weed. You were tripping balls. I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That's an order. Whose is it? I... I don't think... I, I think... I have to let her handle it. Stop treating me and my mom like we're your family platoon! Hey! Leave Joyce out of this! I wish you'd leave Joyce! Like now! Ooh. Oh. Chloe, I'm sorry. I care about your mother and you just keep pushing me. You do not hit her. Don't touch me face. again, asshole. That's the last time. Or I'll bring the cops in here so fast! You're not that dumb. I'd be smart to have you busted. Chloe, someday you'll grow up. Yeah, I don't think I should should step in for that one. That's a family thing. Like... Hey, you okay? I shouldn't be interfering. Welcome to the real step douches of Arcadia Bay. I'm sorry. For what? He would have been a bigger dick if he caught you in here. Yeah, exactly. That's hard to believe. Anyway. Yeah, he hates me, so. <laughs> there is one cool place we can go to in this hick hole. David was such a mean bastard to Chloe. What if I had stepped up to help? I can't. Like, that's their family thing. Damn, what are you waiting for? Open the window. Oh, we're going to sneak out. Okay. Look, it's floating. It's floating. <laughs> it's floating weed. <laughs> Wait, can I? Hey. He's like, oh my gosh. It, it's just floating there. Like, it's like magic. Okay. It's floating weed. <laughs> <laughs> the lighthouse. That'd be that'd be a really cool place to chill at. Just hang out. I mean, it looks beautiful. Wow, look at that sunset. It's so purdy. Such a purdy. Hello, dear. I haven't been here in forever. So 
So why do I feel like I was just here? Uh, cause the nightmare? Yeah. This is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare today. Exactly. I just said that. So. Kick. Kick. Birds are so lucky. They can always escape. I wish I was a bird. Then I could fly away. Wowzer, Chloe drew that to mark our tree for it. So oh. we'd always be able to find each other in case of emergency. Oh, that's cute. <sighs> Campfire. Looks like the youth of Arcadia Bay still come up here to party. Heck yeah. I never made it. Trust no one. How long has that been here? Was that like a clue? For Clearly. Like, the Bigfoots are everywhere. For the whole game. Just trust no one. Don't tell anybody. Too bad it's locked. I remember racing up and down the steps. Girl, let's, let's enjoy the. This would be a nice photo together. of Chloe, framed by the sun. Oh my God, this looks beautiful, dude. Them Kodak moments. Is that even a term anymore? Kodak moment, like. Girl. Sure, you, you don't okay? want to be alone. Sit down if you want. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I wussed out. No worries. I know my step dork can be scary. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed what? a step douche. I didn't want to interfere. You have to experience it firsthand. It's you your. Have to live with I already him. stepped up to him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home. I never trusted David. I mean, I didn't want to interfere on their family problems. I just might make it worse, you know? I should have taken his photo. I should have taken his photo when he flipped out on Kate today. That would be killer blackmail material. Let's bust his ass. He has some kind of weird agenda. Oh, I could have taken he a photo. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? Yeah, I did. Well, yeah, I couldn't help it. Never change. What did you find? Creepy photos of Kate Marsh. Other Blackwell students. This dude takes his job too seriously. He still thinks he's at war or something. He's a total surveillance fetish. Why are there spy cams in the house? I knew you didn't know. Chloe, your house is under surveillance. What are you talking about? There's cameras. There are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a monitor in the garage. I knew it! He is so hella fucking paranoid! I'll keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is bliss. Yeah. No wonder I'm so miserable. Everybody in this town knows everybody's secrets. Is that why they say trust no one? Even yours? Even yours? Not anymore. So what do you have on Nathan? He's an elite asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? Oh. I met him in some shithole bar that didn't card me. He was too rich for the place and too wasted, and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened, Chloe. Now. I was an idiot. I thought he was so blazed it would be an easy score. Oh. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. What about Nathan? So, what about you what and What the Nathan? hell did he do to you? We went to his room at Blackwell. We drank, and I laughed at his rich kid bullshit. He was one step ahead and put oh something my in god. my god. God, Chloe. I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? I know I passed out on the floor. I woke up and that perv was smiling, crawling towards me with a camera. 
you kick him in the Go face? On. Everything was a blur. I tried to kick him in the balls and broke a lamp. Nathan okay. freaked, so I managed to bum rush the door and get the hell out. Okay, good. <sighs> Max, it was insane. At least, oh man. Hell yeah, I'm furious. I am so furious, I can't even speak. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. He's still dangerous. He's still dangerous, Chloe. They're a rich family. I don't know Not about calling you. the cops now. Oh, good thing you notified the principal. I feel safer already. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... I should destiny. tell her about my power. Destiny. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. I miss her, Max. The shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. Well, uh... Her nightmare... It's definitely gonna be destroyed. Uh-oh. Oh no! We're no, back! Back into the fray. Why is this happening to me? Why am I here again? What does it mean? Follow the the deer. Let's go. Is Chloe still up there? Whoa. I have whoa. to find out. Good thing I went this way. Oh. Okay, uh. It's a good thing she could turn back time and while she could stay still. Jeez. It's crazy. Come back. Oh. Oh, get away. Oh, God. Oh, God. No. I was too slow. Alright, I'll step back. Is it clear? Can I go up now? I've never seen a storm like this in Omer. How do I get up there? Am I supposed to race it? Huh. Okay. Nope. Not today. Not today. Not today. Not today. Back, dearie. Oh my lord! The tornado is back! Wait, is it a vortex? Is this for real? That's a tornado. Oh! oh. Nope. Okay, what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? Go, 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 
go, go. This is so awesome. What's this? October 11th? Is this Friday? Oh. That's only four days away. Oh no. So I'm getting visions of the future. The tornado is headed straight for the town. How am I supposed to stop that? What other powers do I have? Chloe, oh. you're here. I'm back. Oh my lord, this is real. It's real. Oh man, this sucks. Max, what's going on? You totally blacked out. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes every 20 years. You just so. No, no, I saw it. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Come on, take a breath, okay? Chloe, I'm not crazy. But there's something else I have to tell you. Something hardcore. Talk to me, Max. I had the same vision earlier in class. When I came out of it, I discovered I could reverse time. Like I said, not crazy. But hi? Right? Listen to me. How do you think I saved you in the bathroom? By reversing exactly. time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get shot, Chloe. Saw you actually die. I was able to go back and hit the fire alarm. Okay, I see you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. <laughs> People don't have those powers, Max. I, I don't know what I have, but I have it. And I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. Whoa. It's snowing. What the hell is this? Snowflakes? What the? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Uh oh. A storm is coming. A storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Tell me everything. Not just a storm. Winter is coming too. Oh, it's the mom. We got a black guy. Aww. Why are you crying? Dougie! Who is that? What's with her? Jeez. This freaking principal. I shouldn't have told him anything. Whatever. Rachel Raquel All right, episode 1 Chrysalis. Chrysalis. I'm just going to let it go through the the credits just in case there's something at the end. But yeah, um I really enjoyed what I played so far. Episode 1's really interesting. My mind blew when they started introducing the the time travel mechanic. That's pretty awesome. Cause like, you know how when we play games like these decision making games, you would think, oh, I probably shouldn't have made that decision. But I like how even though you can change your decision, you're not totally sure if it's the right one. Like, you still don't know how big of a consequ consequence it will be later on like I still don't know what could happen yeah but yeah yeah it's a really it's a really interesting concept and I'm liking where it's leading so far I mean si since it's the first episode it's 
you know, just a lot of uh, exposition, getting, getting to know the characters, but yeah, it's been, it's been pretty crazy. Oh, I can, I can skip through it. All right, um, 66% reported Nathan, comfort Victoria, intervened to help out Kate, he stayed hidden, hmm, you blame Chloe, who would, <laughs> that's messed up, 2%, okay, You didn't let Daniel draw your portrait. What? Oh, I could have met up. You didn't sign Miss Grant's petition. You help Alyssa. You didn't erase Kate Slate. You watered your plant. Didn't touch Dana's pregnancy test. Wow. You let the bird die? What in the world? There was a bird? Like... This was a lot more... In... In... Like... It had a lot more details. Included... Like, extra decisions. That's pretty awesome. I guess next time I have to be a lot more... Thorough. Because half of these, I don't even remember. You didn't write on a dirty RV. Okay. Didn't touch Victoria's photos. Wow. I missed a lot. Refresh. No, it's just refreshing. Is that all? Oh. Got a trailer. She's gonna be. What are you doing at the train tracks? And how'd you get stuck? Exit to me menu. All right. That was awesome. Can't wait for the second one. I hope you guys enjoyed that playthrough of the first episode. I, yeah. Can't wait. I love time travel. So, so cool. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you later.